Hey everyone, Drew from Monkey's Tropicals Adventures. And I'm gonna do a fragrance review today without my sling for my physical therapist, so now I get to do some more range of motion. So, I might be in a better mood doing this review. Anyways, Ralph Lauren Purple Label. Uh, amazing scent. I bought, I bought all this when it first came out in 2003. I was at uh, Saks Fifth Avenue um, after dinner. We're kind of walking through with another couple and um, I smelt it and the lady's like, oh, this is the newest scent from Ralph Lauren. I was like, oh shit, this is good stuff. So I, uh, I purchased a bottle. This is obviously not the bottle uh, that I purchased in 2003, but back then uh, at Saks Fifth, it was going for about $82. Uh, now it looks like for, um, this is a 4.2 ounce, 125 ml bottle. It's now going for about 105 if you buy it online at Barney's New York or if you buy it straight from Ralph Lauren online you're looking at 102. So let's get into the bottle. So it's this beautiful glass purple bottle that you can kind of see through. You got your batch number uh, with a black top and black cap. You can see the, the RL on there. Standard automizer. Just a, it's a really pretty bottle. I really like it. It's nice. So what's in this wonderful juice? So you got top notes of blackberry, green coriander, and green leaves, and mandarin. And uh, definitely right out the gate, um, when you first spray it, you can definitely smell that the citrus of the mandarin and that uh, blackberry very well. Um, you got heart notes of tobacco flower, I like tobacco, um, fresh sage, and green thyme, and base notes of mahogany wood, suede, warm musk, and oak moss. So, like I said, that right out the gate, you get that citrus and that, that blackberry, um, and then it dries down to um, like a dry, woody, uh, spicy. It's, uh, spicy is a good way to put it, in, in, a, in a good way. Um, I can, maybe it's wishful thinking that I can smell that tobacco leaves, but I, I do get that hint of tobacco leaves. So, um, you just, you get all these pleasant smells from that, that citrus and the, and the fruity of the blackberry and then to that spicy, and then it, it, it kind of calms down to that dry, woody uh, smell. So it's it's just a beautiful scent. When would I wear this? Uh, I definitely wouldn't wear it in warm weather. Uh, definitely a fall and winter scent. Uh, definitely you could probably wear it in the spring, but I wouldn't be wearing this in anything over 75 degrees. It just, I don't think it would work well um, due to kind of like that spicy. It just, I don't think it would sit well on the skin, and I don't I don't think it would it smell as well. The uh, the projection is is pretty strong, um, not overpowering, not pungent, but it is it is a strong scent. I'd say one or two squirts and you're good. Uh, and the longevity is it's definitely something that um, that I could smell throughout the day on my clothes, and I can still smell it. So um, with that being said, I definitely think this is kind of a sleeper scent. Um, I haven't seen any reviews I think on this I'm you know I, I haven't gone digging but it's not something I've, I've seen pop up on YouTube or in anyone's feed so I thought I'd kind of put it out there because Ralph Lauren always they do make some pretty good sense and there's a couple other things I want to try but I definitely want to put this out there um, and definitely uh, as I'm kind of working out my Instagram my YouTube channel with all this downtime um, I'm thinking about doing uh, some giveaways soon. I think I'm going to do some decants of this in my giveaway. So I think kind of just get that out there along with this review. So if uh, you're seeing this on Instagram, please like and follow me on Instagram. If you're seeing this on YouTube, please like and subscribe. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them below. Thanks for watching. Take care.